okay so this is an update of um, my reactive framework reactive ui framework for neovim so this is what i can do now i can display the time and you can see it's um, reactive and this is not really event driven uh, this is more like a state driven you are programming to a state you know you are building your ui to a state and when the state changes it automatically renders the component that's the idea here of this framework like i mean many other ui frameworks um similar to react.js and uh, solid.js let's say the name comes from uh, solid.js you know create signal uh, you can create a signal this is sort of like uh, in in react.js world this is like a use state hook um, so basically you are getting a getter and setter and whenever, whenever you are using a getter inside a component it's going to be registered under that I mean like the framework going to remember the dependency between the signal and the component so the next time when you are setting the time for example uh, and it will cause a re-render so that's what's happening here and if I go down here you can see I have a set interval function that I have created using libuv um, and it each and every second it's going to call this on repeat function uh, that's the that that's how it works and down here I have uh, I'm setting the time basically doing the same thing as of the initial value of this signal so this is causing a re-render of um, of the root component and as a result it's, it's displaying the time so that's the idea and uh, the way you render this on a buffer is using this function right here you can render this on any buffer you want you just pass in the root component of course you can have multiple nested components that works too so this is it thanks for watching have a nice day